Hello, everyone. I am delighted you are here today. We will talk about something very special. How to speak like me. Speaking English can be enjoyable and easy. I want to show you how. When I was young, I did not speak English well. I was shy and scared to make mistakes, but I learned a simple secret lesson: speak and enjoy the process. English is like music; you need to feel it. One day, I met a friend who spoke English very well. I asked her, "How do you speak so well?" She smiled and said, "I listen a lot." I listened to English stories, songs, and people that day. I started listening more. It changed everything. Listening is the first key. When you listen, you learn how words sound. You learn how sentences flow. You start to understand how people express themselves. Listening is like planting a seed. The more you listen. The more you grow. When I listen to stories, I feel like I am inside the story. I imagine the characters, the places, and the feelings. It makes the words come alive. Listening to stories is not just about learning it; it is about feeling. Do you like music? Music is another great way to learn English. When you listen to a song, you learn new words and expressions. You also learn how to pronounce words correctly. Music makes learning fun. Speaking is the next step. Do not be afraid to speak. When you speak. You practice what you have learned. It is okay to make mistakes. Mistakes help you learn. Remember, every time you speak, you get better. I remember the first time I spoke English in front of others. I was so nervous. My hands were shaking and my heart was beating fast. But I told myself, "You can do it." I spoke slowly and clearly, and guess what? People understood me. It felt amazing. Speaking is like exercising. The more you do it, the stronger you become. So speak every day. Talk to friends. Talk to yourself. Or even talk to your pet. Just keep speaking. Do you know what helped me the most? I started talking to myself in English. When I was alone, I would think in English and say words out loud. It felt strange at first, but it worked. My speaking skills improved a lot. Practice makes perfect, but practice should be fun. If you enjoy what you do, you will want to do it more. Find what you love and connect it to English. If you love cooking, watch cooking shows in English. If you love sports, read about them in English. I once read a quote: "The more you practice, the luckier you get." It is true. The more you practice speaking English, the better you will become. And soon, people will say, "Wow, you speak so well." Learning English is like a journey. Every step you take brings you closer to your goal. Some days you will feel like you are walking fast. 
other days, you may feel like you are moving slowly. But keep going. Every step counts. When you start to think in English, you know you are improving. Thinking in English helps you speak faster and more naturally. It is like switching on a light. Suddenly, everything becomes clearer. Do you have a favorite word in English? Mine is hope. It is a simple word, but it carries so much meaning. Hope is what keeps us going, even when things are hard. When I speak, I always try to share hope. Your voice is powerful. The world can hear your thoughts, dreams, and ideas when you speak. Do not be afraid to use your voice. Your voice matters. One day, I was walking in the park. I saw a little girl playing with her dog. She was laughing and speaking in English. Her words were simple, but they were full of joy. It reminded me that English is not just about rules. It is about expressing yourself. If you want to speak like me, remember this. Keep it simple. Use words that feel natural to you. Speak from your heart. When you speak from your heart, people will listen. I love to tell stories. Stories are a wonderful way to practice speaking. When you tell a story, you connect with your listener. You make them feel something. Stories are powerful. Do you have a story to tell? Share it in English. It does not have to be perfect. What matters is that it is your story. When you tell your story, you give others a chance to know you better. I remember a story my grandmother told me. It was about a little bird who wanted to fly. The bird was scared at first, but it tried anyway. Slowly, the bird learned to fly high in the sky. My grandmother said, Just like the bird, you can fly too. Just keep trying. Learning to speak English is like learning to fly. At first, it may seem hard. But with practice and patience, you will soar. You will find your wings. Do not worry about speaking perfectly. Perfection is not the goal. Communication is. If you can share your message, you have succeeded. People will understand you, even if you make a mistake. One time, I made a big mistake while speaking. I used the wrong word, and everyone laughed. But instead of feeling bad, I laughed too. It was a humorous moment, and I learned something new. Mistakes are our best teachers. Confidence is key. When you speak with confidence, people believe in you. Even if you are not sure about something, speak with confidence. Your words will carry more weight. I met a man who was learning English. He was very shy. He said, I am afraid people will laugh at my accent, I told him. Your accent is part of who you are. It makes you unique. Do not hide it. Celebrate it. Your accent is your story. 
It shows where you come from and who you are. Be proud of it. When you speak, let your accent shine. It is a beautiful part of you. Practice speaking with different people. The more you speak, the more comfortable you will become. You will learn new words, new phrases, and new ways to express yourself. I once had a friend from another country. We spoke English together every day. Sometimes we did not understand each other, but we kept trying. Over time, our English improved, and so did our friendship. Learning English is not just about words. It is about connecting with others. It is about understanding and being understood. When you speak, you build bridges between people. A wise person once said, the best way to learn is to try teaching English to someone else. It could be a friend, a family member, or even yourself. When you teach, you learn twice. Teaching English helped me improve my own skills. It made me think about how I use the language. It also gave me a chance to share what I love with others. Do you know what else helps? Reading out loud. When you read out loud, you practice your pronunciation. You also get used to hearing your own voice in English. It is a simple but powerful way to improve. I remember reading a book out loud to my little sister. She did not understand all the words, but she loved the way they sound. It made me realize that speaking is not just about meaning. It is also about rhythm and melody. Speaking English can be like singing. Find the rhythm in the words. Feel the flow of the sentences. When you speak with rhythm, your words will dance. Imagine you are telling a story to a child. How would you speak? You would use simple words, clear sentences, and a gentle tone. This is how you should speak English. Make it simple for others to understand you. If you ever feel stuck, take a deep breath. Relax. Speaking English is not a race. It is a journey. Enjoy each step of the way. Do you have a favorite quote? Mine is, every day is a new chance to learn. It reminds me that learning never stops. Each day brings new opportunities to grow and improve. You do not need to speak like someone else. Speak like yourself. Your voice is unique, and your way of speaking is special. When you are true to yourself, others will listen. If you ever doubt yourself, remember this. You are capable. You can learn. You can grow. Every word you speak brings you closer to your goal. Imagine you are speaking to a friend. How would you talk? You would be kind, patient, and understanding. Speak to yourself the same way. Be gentle with yourself. Learning English is like planting a garden. You start with a small seed. You water it every day. You give it sunlight and care. Slowly, 
it grows into something beautiful. Your English skills are like that garden. They will grow with time, patience, and love. Keep watering them. Keep caring for them. If you make a mistake, it is okay. Mistakes are like rain. They help your garden grow. Without them, you would not learn. I once tried to learn a new word. I said it wrong many times, but each time I got better. Finally, I said it right. It felt so good. That is the power of practice. Every time you speak, you are practicing. Every word you say is a step forward. Keep taking those steps. Soon, you will look back and see how far you have come. English is not just a language. It is a way to connect with people all over the world. Speaking English can lead to new opportunities, friendships, and experiences. Think about the places you want to visit. Think about the people you want to meet. English can take you there. It can help you share your story with the world.